Hey, in this video, we are going to be learning about duplicate special. It's important to know about tools like these as they can actually end up saving us a lot of time. So if we go ahead and look here, we have a step, one step of what will become our staircase. But before we go ahead and start duplicating things, let's just go over a few of the options for the tool. You can get to duplicate special by going to edit, duplicate special, and then just click this little option box at the end. The main sort of thing we could change is the geo type. So copy, well, makes a copy of the duplicated geometry. Instance creates an instance of the object. And when we do this, Maya is just redisplaying the geometry being instanced. So making a change to the parent object will have an effect on all instances. The group under setting is pretty self-explanatory. So let's just get onto the juicy stuff. Here we have translate, rotate, and scale parameters, which we can use to apply an offset value to each duplicated mesh. And an easy way to see what values we want to use for the offset is to do a test run, duplicating the standard way to get the values we want in the channel box. So we want to make a staircase. So I think position in the step, something like this should work well. So now notice now we have the Y and the Z values which we need. So let's just go ahead and copy and paste these into the tool. The inputs are X, Y, and Z in that order. So we can copy the Y into here, just using control C and control V. And then the Z value into this input box here. The number of copies in this example is how many steps we want. So let's just go ahead and do 100. And I guess you can kind of see why this tool is so powerful. As to do manually 100 duplications would, while not impossible, would definitely take a while. As you can see, if we just go ahead and use Shift D, so I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, please consider hitting those like and subscribe buttons. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.